Hey guys, I'm going to show you how to get Sparks Kilowatt Secret Package in the game Azure Mines. So after you go through an initial uh, training tutorial thing, we're going to go here to the teleporter array. Now from the teleporter, we're going to go over here. This is the main mining area. Now in the back on the left, you can see we've got our good friend Sparks Kilowatt. You go and have a conversation with her. You got to make sure that you highlight her and then click on her. She says right here, find a rare amethyst or five ruby ores. So the amethyst, you find one of those, it's purple, or the ruby, you find uh, five of those, those are red. So if you get a purple one, good job. Those are rare to find. And if you get that, just get that one, bring it back to her, then you're good to go. But uh, for the rubies, I'd recommend just dig straight down at first because we're just going to dig straight down uh, to, you can see up at the top, it says how many meters below surface. So we want to go to at least 65 meters below the surface and about there is where we're going to start to see rubies now rubies are going to be more common than the amethyst for sure and at some point you're also going to have a full inventory and you're going to have to resurface we're going to show you what happens but uh right there right there we got a red one we've got a ruby as soon as we got here to 65 66 meters below the surface we ran right into a ruby now those take a little bit more time to dig out but it's not too long so there we go we've got one ruby so far out of the five total that we are searching for so we're just going to kind of go level now that we're at 65 or 66 meters below because around this area you should be able to find a lot of them but it says inventory is full i have to go and empty it at my base so on the bottom left it shows what you need to do to resurface i've got a game pad so it says press the y button and then in that area this thing right here you can go and empty your inventory uh, i'm going to get rid of everything except for the ruby so i'm going to get rid of 100 percent of all the other stuff but I'm gonna keep the ruby in my inventory. So now we're gonna just head on back over to the mining area and we're gonna to try to mine out some more of that ruby. So I've still got this hole that I started earlier. We're just gonna drop right in there and it's gonna take us down to the level that we're looking for. So we're just gonna keep on looking for the ruby or amethyst. I mean, if we get lucky enough and we find ourselves the, uh, the purple one, we just get that one, go straight up to the top and we're good to go. But ruby, there we go, ruby number two. We've got over here, and they're not too hard to find. You just keep going. See, there's one right over here just around the corner from where that uh, second one was. So at this point, you can see on the bottom right, it shows how many rubies we've got. We've got three, and here we go with the fourth one that we've just found. So yeah, this area, just around this area, 64, 65 meters below the surface, it is a good place to look for the rubies. So we're still just looking for one more we've got four out of five rubies at this point and we're going to find that last one or again if we can find an amethyst a purple one we just need one of those but again those ones are super rare so if you find one of those good job here we go we found a fifth ruby so there we go now that we've got five rubies we're just going to go back up to the surface i'm going to uh this little thing here and going to get rid of some of the other stuff that i don't need it's going to keep my five rubies and we're going to head back across to sparks back where she was in the beginning and we're going to talk to her again one more time and now that we've got all five of the rubies we can click on redeem and it says mission complete and you can see on the bottom right that we've got ourselves that badge thank you for watching guys and if you'd like to support please use code deeterplay when buying robux and also make sure you subscribe and you've got the notification bell on not only for the launchers because i've got launchers for all of these launch boxes but also future news events and free items that hit the catalog on roblox so thank you for watching and we'll talk to you guys later